Hello, Internetians, and welcome to Fuck My Life. So, this is To The Moon. Again. Again. You don't understand why that's annoying, because he's forgot to start the game capture, so go over there and do your shit. Get out of here and stop it. He's over there. Deja vu, I've just been in this place before. Higher on the street. He is entirely unaware of the story up until this point. Fuck my nuts. You got two children. One of them's a girl. One of them's a boy. The girl's playing the piano and the boy's watching her. The camera's gonna shake and they're both gonna turn around and be like, what the fuck was that? It's gonna be two scientists. Boom! Two scientist people just crashed a car trying to avert a squirrel. Welcome to an angry, uh, two cats run a by up there. Welcome to an angry, bitter cynic who plays a really emotional game. Fucking bite me! Where were you looking, Neil? Yeah, fuck you, Neil. Dr. Neil Watts. Well, excuse me for heroically evading a squirrel. Good job. Squirrel's dead. He's like, oh, well, we hit the tree anyways. Boss is gonna get pissed at you. What did we say it was a puppy? He's a cat person. Screw it. Life's complicated. Let's get the equipment. Click on the back of the thing, get the equipment. Got the sucker, let's roll. Click on the arrow and go. They forget to lock the car. Locks the car. Thank you. Goes into the bush thing. Goes up here. Goes back up here. Goes up to the boulder. Can't get past the boulder. Surprise! It's actually an air bubble that you can't surpass. And then they're like, maybe we can push it. Maybe we can jack it with a rock. Maybe we'll just leave. I'm gonna find a branch because I know where that is. There's a branch right there. You got the branch. You hit the- you put the branch, you poke it, the thing deflates. You're like, what the fuck was this shit? You're like, I don't know. This looks like an air bubble. Fuck it. Let's keep going. You press- press the fuck go. Control- I know how to control the people. We- we go up here. Okay, we're back. Don't ask where we went. Because we won't tell you. We didn't go anywhere. We were always here. We actually ceased to exist for for a quick second. We're up here. There's a there's a lighthouse, and, and and there's nothing here to do. Okay, so uh, we're just gonna keep going down here, going down here, going down. Here. Door button. Uh-huh. Yeah, door button. Yo, answer the door, buddy. -o. Ma, they're here. Looks out the window. Crawls out of the window. Flies out of the window. Not a bad, not a bad bled pace to retire at, huh? I could do better. I bet you could, Watt. Watts, you piece of shit. Night shifts. Love him or hate him. I don't like you. You know the answer, you stupid owl. He's a stupid owl. It's probably gonna be another all nighter, you know. I know. We know. I doubt they'd have any coffee. Shut up. Please shut up. And the ocean waves will sing lullabies. Not through your bothering, they won't. Doors open, go. Don't forget the equipment. The equipment. <laughs> you don't get paid at all. Joking. They give him a dollar every time he says a word. Act one. I don't want to call anyone, but I'm only flat. Sorry, there was something in my mouth. It was candy. What's up, Lily? Uh, yep. I'm coming on 
Let's make sure we notice. That's okay. We tend to be bad at predicting deaths as well. Oh. Are you the patient's daughter? Oh no, I am just his caretaker. Children! There's a door there? And these are my children, Sarah and Tommy. It's not exactly a 9 to 5 job, so Johnny lets us live here. I suppose it's Johnny is our man. Johnny. Listen, if it's a kid we're dealing with, I don't think we're the ones you want. No, no, he just prefers to be called that. He's upstairs right now with his medical doctor. Come with me. Okay. So am I still controlling the doctors, or... Come on, grab the case and let's go. If my back breaks one day, I'll sue you with the insurance claim. <coughs> Received equipment. Again. Let's head upstairs before I drop this. Nah, I'm gonna follow the kids. Because I'm a scrub. The patient is waiting upstairs, better not waste time. Oh, fine. I won't waste time. Oh, I, I clicked over here, but but okay. And just just walk through the uh, the chair there to the piano. Go upstairs. Yeah, no big deal. Clipping and the like. Okay, they're gone. Whoever gets there first gets to play the melody. Boom. No fair. You pushed me. Huh? <laughs> did not. Did too. Did not. This goes on for some time. Whatever, you get the boring two notes anyway. Alright. Very nice. So, I apologize for the cynical saltiness beforehand. I just, <laughs> just wanted to get through it as best as possible. Ah, and I didn't start my shit. Big. I didn't start my 15 minutes on my watch like I was going to do whatever. Those kids are pretty good for their age. Hey, you're the one who said there was no time to waste. And incidentally, I'm the one who's carrying the weight of a small meteoroid. Suck it up. <laughs> Alright, where are we going? Let's talk to you first. Ready to set up? Set machine down. Yes. It'll just be a moment. <laughs> okay. Written by Ken Gao. <coughs> I'm sure common household power outlet is sufficient. We're the ex we're the experts. Crap. Yes. Um, just keeping on toes. Huh. Topest of text. Bottomest of text. Okay. How is he doing? Not so well. If I were to say he's got just a day or two left. Well, that's depressing. That's plenty of time. So, you two can grant him any wish, huh? Try, at least. But we always succeed because we're awesome. And humble. Don't forget humble. So what's the wish? The moon. I wish the moon. Yeah, same. The moon he wants to go to. Okay. The geezers just keep on getting crazier, huh? Shut your bitch ass up. So can you do it? No. <laughs> it depends. She meant to say yes. Why don't you tell us about your client here? That I don't really know much. Johnny's an old man, though through the year the two years that I have worked here, he rarely spoke. <clears throat> he worked as a craftsman for most of his life, and his wife passed away two years ago. Oh well, that sucks. I don't really know many details. I would have known more if I were his paper boy for Pete's sake. Ah, oh, you're a dick. Shush, just do your thing. 
Well, I suppose if you look around the house, you may find some more info. Oh, okay. I suppose Johnny won't mind since he signed... Alright, which one of us plays detective? We're not gonna let Watts do this delicate procedure. Thanks for the offer, but I'm busy leaving a butt print on this chair. <laughs> right, do continue. Tommy and Sarah can show you around. They're probably at the piano downstairs. Thank you. Goes to the piano and bum bum ba! They're not there. Wait, come back for a moment. I have something for you. Yeah, what up? Shoo, go to your detective work. What? Oh, it's different doctor. Here, take this. Received remote patient monitor? What? That'll keep you updated on Johnny's status. Oh, no. Johnny's heart monitor is now activated in menu. Uh-huh. Oh. Connects wirelessly to the patient's local monitor for live supervision. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Okay. We'll just, we'll just do that. Uh, and we're out of here. Okay! So, now that that's the jazz, um... I think after I talk to the kids, I'm gonna stop. Or whatever. Let's keep going. Uh, talk to them, please. Or just hourglass them. What you want? Show me around the house. Sarah and Tommy, right? Your mother asked you to, to show me around the house. Okay, maybe we will. Maybe. Ha! <laughs> yeah. Great. <laughs> Pulls out a gun. Show me around the house. <laughs> Where the candy cane mom hit hides from us. Yeah, or that. There's a giant candy cane on top of a high shelf that we can't reach. It's in the kitchen. Ma put it there to save for when we get it for us. Get it for us. We can move the house. What do you say? Well, <laughs> cut the crap and help. Sure, I'll go get it for you. Well, why not? All right. And the kitchen door is right next to the stairs. Now go. I see two pairs of stairs. Going in this one. Mmm, candy spot. There's that candy cane. Oh. You're shitting me. What's this? Wow, we need a light. Let's see, can we push a chair over? Jesus crap. Uh, let's... Can we open the... Nope, I guess not. Um... There we go. Receive candy cane. Door. Door. Terrible calories. Door. Alright. Oh, come on now. There we go. Okay, I got what you wanted. Good old candy cane. Candy cane. Clear this instant. I won't sneeze on it. I said, what the hell was that? <laughs> okay. I know. There's this funny room in the basement. I don't like that funny room. Okay. What do you mean by funny room? You'll see. It's weird. We need to get the keys, though. Ugh. The old man hid it inside a book in the study. Okay. This is the book room. 
The key to the funny room is in the thickest book on the upper shelf. The upper shelf. Pilgrim's Guide to Origami, Volume 1, The Key to Avoiding Paper Cuts. <laughs> That's funny. Dust Light. Okay. Uh, well, let's turn on the light, I guess. There we go. So, like, up here? Oh, I guess I need to read the books? Welcome to Origami is already supposed to Wikipedia pages, I guess. Okay. I'm trying to find the largest book on the tallest shelf. Uh, maybe not yet. The broom key. Oh, there we go. He shows his hiding spot well. <laughs> okay. Tom used to throw books at me and call it a book fight. Until one day I threw one back and he needed a band-aid. Hehe. <laughs> Wow. Just a bunch of books in here. Dave, nothing I don't know about, though. Okay. So she's scrappy and he's smart. You can open the funny room in the basement now. Okay. This is the basement. You can play hide and seek here. Turn on the light before you trip over something. It trips on something going over to the light. Alright, where's this... Funny room? Because that's the funny room. There's nothing. Oh. Boxes. Colored papers. Colored spelled with a U. Was this game made in the UK? I bet it was. In case you couldn't hear that, that was Blake saying probably in the background. The door is locked. Open with the room key. Let's go in here. It's a cave in here. Oh, look, a light's... Um... Um... A broken music box. A stuffed toy platypus. It's adorable, though. To annoy Neil. And adorable enough to annoy Neil. Might come in handy. I'm gonna poke it. Received a toy platypus. A rabbit folded out of paper. A rabbit folded out of paper. A rabbit folded out of paper. A broken music box. Oh, okay. I guess we can't go over there. Okay. Did you see it? know about all those rabbits. Nothing. The old man didn't want anyone to go inside, so he never told him. There's more of them, actually. Where? Inside the abandoned lighthouse. It's just beneath this cliff. Wanna go see? I got the keys. You aren't supposed to go in there, are you? Hee <laughs> hee! Rebellious. Remind me to never take you to Neil's house. So you want to go see the lighthouse? Well, it's rather cold outside, but... Decision? Yeah, let's go to the lighthouse. You know what? Fine. Maybe you'll tell me more about the rabbits. Let's go check the lighthouse out. Aren't I supposed to be learning something about this old man? I'll be around about The words will make you out and out Uh, yeah. For the record, if nobody heard why he sang that, it's because... It's a JoJo reference. Yeah, and I said in a very roundabout way. Alright, so we're gonna conclude right here. Alright, And I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait a few seconds, there it is, and then I'm gonna resync. So, uh... Uh, I get to repeat the mouth. One, two, three, four, five, six. Alright. Some shit like that. Ah, uh, so stay interesting, ladies and gents. Mm -hmm.